great food, great wine, and more importantly, great people. This is really easy for me, I mean. Deb knows that I come into the Vineyard Wine Bar and Bistro all the time, so Michaela's choice this week is the Wine Bar and Bistro, joined by Deborah Linden, the owner, and Rob Christie, the sommelier. Welcome. Thank, Thank you. you. We're, we're thrilled to be here. Oh my gosh, so happy to have you. So obviously, you know, my favorite date night is with y'all, but why would Central Florida just love the Vineyard as much as I do? Well, we're known as a neighborhood wine bar, but we're really much more than that. We have a great staff that gets to know our customers very well, although we don't refer to them as customers, we refer to them as our guests, but honestly they're more like family. And we, we offer fine dining under the ambiance of the chandeliers. It's a very casual environment, but I call it a casual elegance, if you will. Um, chef makes amazing food from our scratch kitchen. And of course, Rob, uh, full-time sommelier, pairs all of the, the wines perfectly with our menu. So he does, a, he does an amazing job. But why would somebody come on a date, right? Um, the, the, the vineyard has uh, a, a unique, um, quaint, intimate setting. And we have entertainment, we have nice music. It's a very welcoming and a very comfortable environment for people to come in. We have outdoor dining under a uh, covered roof and it's just a really nice environment. We have uh, people coming in on blind days. Of course, you can always tell when somebody's coming in on a blind date, right? Uh, but we try to make it very welcoming for yeah. them. And our guests refer to us as the neighborhood cheers. So, I love that, yeah, neighborhood it's very fun. cheers. Yeah. What, what a title. So tell me a little bit about what you brought with you today. Oh, well, today we brought in our charcuterie board, which is a chef selected sampling of cured meats and cheeses. We've got a little cheddar, little port wine cow's milk cheese and manchego and salami, prosciutto and mortadelle. We've also brought in our crispy artichoke hearts. Oh, yeah, one of my favorites. With a zesty lemon aioli, they're fabulous. <laughs> and last but certainly not least, our short rib. Slow braised short rib over fingerling potatoes with fava beans and a red wine jus. Just melts in your mouth. Absolutely. That doesn't yeah. surprise me for one <laughs> moment. So there's a lot of interest like in the wines. You wanna tell me a little bit about that? I think wines are conversation starters. They're icebreakers. You can have a great conversation. Not everybody tastes the same thing. Not everybody experiences the same thing, but it's great to talk about. It's great to experience together. And it is also very disarming, you know? Especially have a glass on those of wine. blind dates, you know? <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. What better to do it over than a little glass of wine, or a bottle for that matter? Yeah, no kidding. So do you guys have any other like kind of wine events, so to speak? Absolutely. We do tastings that are casual, family-style tastings charcuterie boards, ep appetizers, taste through four or five different wines from a particular winery, and then sit and chat about them. Those are typically hosted by ourselves and winery representatives, if not the actual winery owners. And then we also do monthly course dinners, four and five course dinners that are also sponsored by the wineries. Talk about them, enjoy them. The beautiful thing about the vineyard is you can take the wine home with you, which is very different than most typical restaurants. Definitely, I think so. I mean, when I come in, I'm just so blown away by not only the wine, the food, the ambiance. What really separates you from other locations just kind of in the area for a date night? Right, well, one of the things that makes us mo most unique is that we are not just a wine bar, but we're also a full service restaurant and a wine shop. Now, there aren't many restaurants really that uh, have packaged wine to go home, right? So uh, we have it set up so that all of the bottles of wine that we have in our wine shop are competitively priced to take home. So if you were to pull a bottle off the wall and enjoy a bottle of wine with your dinner, uh, we just charge a simple $10 enjoy it here fee, uh, or which is a, like a corkage fee. So it's very affordable for everybody. People uh, enjoy amazing wines with their dinner and then they can buy bottles to take home. So you don't generally see that in a restaurant for Absolutely reasons not. that we've talked Absolutely about. Yeah. So where can people find more about you? So we have a website, thevineyardorlando.com, and I send out a weekly newsletter. And uh, if you'd like to receive my weekly newsletters with chef specials and who the entertainment and uh, all the different things, uh, exciting things that we're doing there, uh, you can just go on the home page and sign up and you'll start receiving my weekly e email. So, Well, I yeah. love it. Deb, Rob, thank you so much. And go check out the vineyard and we will be right back after this short break. Thank you.